Not good. Not good for Shohei Otani, but that's a Dodgers problem. Giants, let's go down there and set the tone today at Petco Park. That's all I'm looking forward to. Picking up baby Chez at 1245. We're rushing to the house. We're 10 minutes away from the crib, from her preschool. And then we're going to watch some Giants. I'm going to let her watch Coco and everything like that. It's going to be a lot. Sorry, Anna. I know you're listening, but she's going to need a lot of popcorn today, a lot of junk food, because we got Giants on the tube. we got March Madness. It is Giants baseball. We will get to some Draymond Green sound. He spoke this morning on Bleach Report Live, and we'll hear from him. But damn, I am. God, my juice is flowing, man. I've got the 97 lineup up right now, Shasky. Give it to me. Rick Wilkins, a catcher. JT Snow, first base. Mm-hmm. Jeff Kent, second base. 29 home runs, 121 RBI. 29 home runs for second base. <laughs> Jose Vizcaino. Jose Vizcaino. You know how you spell that? With 37 E's. Yeah, I've heard this. I've told that joke for the last 30 years. Every Giant fan has told that joke. <laughs> um, little Billy Miller at third oh, base. Oh, Bill Miller. I remember JT the Number Brick 32. on his late night show. Come on, Giants. You really got to try out little Billy Miller? Hey, he won a batting uh, title with the Boston Red Sox. Won a World Series, right? Yeah. I love Bill Miller. They had a good run at third baseman there for a they minute. Did. David Bell, Bill Miller. Yep. They did a good job there. Yep, Keep going. No doubt. Barry Bonds, of course. Yeah, yeah. All he did in 97 was still 37 bases. Was it Marvin? <laughs> hold on, hold on. Let me get these numbers out. <laughs> Give me Bonds. It's 97. I mean, yeah. It's 97 years. It's whole hub. 291 batting average. OPS over 1,000. 40 jacks. Yeah. 101 RBIs. Got walked 145 times. Yeah. Stole 37 bases. That was when he was skinny. <laughs> just, just a whole yeah. hub. Barry Bonds season. And then we got Daryl Hamilton. Center field. Batted 270. Five. Uh, number set. Uh, maybe number five. I don't have the numbers okay. up there. Uh, Glenn Adel Hill. Glenn Adel Hill. Uh, hit. war number one. War number one. Brian Johnson also back up catcher. Oh, yeah. Eleven home Stanford. runs. Remember Mark Lewis? Mark Lewis hit ten home runs that yeah, year. I do. Mark Lewis. Do Damon Barry Hill. Marvin. Damon Barry Hill. Wow. Marvin Menard. Menard. I knew Marvin Menard. Rich Arulia, Rich Arulia. Young Richie. Yeah. Uh, Marcus Jensen. Uh-huh. Dante Powell. Jacob Cruz. Dante Powell. <laughs> Doug Mirabelli. Doug Mirabelli. He played yeah. eight games that year. The Boston Red Sox. And did you get the? The starters, Sean Estes. Oh, yeah, Estes, 55. 19 to 5. Yeah. Kirk Reader, 13 to 6. Oh, yeah, Kirk Reader was awesome, 46. Mark Gardner. Mark Gardner, 4.29, what a great great ERA. Position. William Van Landing. Oh, William Van Launching Pad. Yeah, we, I knew that what was coming. What a guy. I almost said that. He had but great I, hair. I don't want to disrespect him. Wilson Alvarez, who they traded Wilson for. Wilson Alvarez, the, the lefty, yep. You remember they traded for him. Yep. Uh, Danny Darwin. Danny Darwin. <laughs> he was in that trade with the White Darwinism. Sox. Darwinism. Yep. Uh, Julio Tavares was coming out Julian. that bullpen. Scarface. Doug Henry, Jim Poole, who you mentioned. Jim Rod, Poole. Rod Beck, Keith Folk. Keith Folk, remember he got number 29. Start, remember Boston he got his, as well. You know where his first ever start was? Huh. He goes at the King Dome against the Seattle Mariners. Really? Or he could have been a second start. Maybe not as bad. I remember <laughs> he, he got a start. Me, he just told it to me like it was the word of God. Yeah, no. Come I, on, I, King. No, no, all right, all right. Here we go. I'm going to look Keith at this game Folk. Ball. I, I got to look at this game ball because I remember He was this. an A too, right? He's he was around the block for yeah, a minute. He, he was got definitely. He, he was a closer. He became a really good closer. All right, here you go. Ninety seven. Yep. He pitched at Seattle, but it wasn't his first start. <laughs> but he pitched at Seattle. I'll never forget this uh, game with the extra innings in the kingdom. Uh, he lasted five innings, gave up nine hits, and gave up five runs. So when you and say- he gave up three home runs in that game. I think Griffey hit a bomb in that game. That's all I remember. Is like Keith Folk him out of the game. He was an All Star with the A's. So he was. See, I told, I told yeah. you. At, but, 191 but, saves. When you go back to those Mariner teams, I swear we could name the entire infield. Yeah. He, by the way, Keith Folk won a World Series with the Boston Red Sox. I, I just oh, said four. that. Oh, you did. Yeah. I was. I was yeah. pulling the shaft. Uh, you were, but it's okay. I was, I was. I was deep in the sauce right here. I'm looking at John Johnstone, Terry ah, Mulholland, John Johnstone, <laughs> Roberto Hernandez. Oh, Roberto Hernandez. Pat, He's still gonna hit Pat somebody. Rap. Pat Rapp coming over yeah. from the Marlins. R A A P. Yep. R A A P. R R A P P. Oh, I thought it was R A P P. Yeah, and I got R A P P on this one. Uh, baseball reference. And then I'm wrong. Doug Creek, Corey Bailey. Yeah, Richard. Steve Lucha. Decker uh, wasn't still part of that team. Uh, I don't see Steve Decker on this roster. Don't see him on the roster. Nope. Scarsoni. 97 Giants. Oh, wow. 90 and 72. 90 and 72. If I were to say super utility Giants from back in the day, let's just do let's do word association. Super I'm going to start utility. Get, yeah, super. Like if I say like Mike Bellinger, I go Mike Benjamin. Mike Benjamin. Wow. <laughs> I wow. remember him. I Mike do Benjamin. remember him. Remember he had the 14 hits in three games him. at Wrigley Field? Kelsey it was like Thompson. a record. <laughs> oh, Specs a little later. Yeah, no doubt. Specs was solid. What about. 
Dave Martinez. Dave Martinez. Dave Martinez. I love Dave Martinez. Now a manager with the Nationals. Absolutely. Um, I'm going to probably have to go Tiny Mike Felder. Tiny Mike Felder. I do love Tiny Or Kevin Mike Bass. Felder. Kevin Bass, outfielder. Uh, Reggie Sanders, Ellis Burks. Oh, come on. Some of my favorites. We could, I love this game. Do you guys yeah. know what game we're playing? Yeah, we're just naming It's called Reminiscing. Giants. Reminiscing called on Great Giants. Giants. This is what guys do. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, we're just opening day. We go down the rabbit <laughs> right. hole. So here, let's go. Let's go. Brad <laughs> Hennessy, Kevin Correa, right. Brian Hickerson. I love Brian Hickerson. Oh Brian my Hickerson God. is one of my favorite number three starters of all time. <laughs> There's just the meme out there where like girls are talking. It's just like guys can literally just meet each other and name random players oh, and become best friends. You, yes. Yes. This is what we do. That's what I tell my what wife. I go, hun, your friend's husband doesn't like sports. Yeah. It's really hard for me to connect. You just don't like him. No, he doesn't like or, sports. Or when they try to talk sports with you, oh, and you can the see they're struggling to do it. I was like, well, you don't, we don't have to do this. Oh, yeah. like, and, we don't have to. And I sometimes look at these guys trying to talk to me. And it looks at these guys trying to talk to me, and she'd be like, they have no idea what they're getting into. Yeah, they have no and clue. And Anna told me, she goes, I thought I dated dudes who love sports and were like sports fanatics. She goes, then I married. Then I met you. <laughs> then I met you. And it's like, oh, these guys don't know no, anything. Anna, we're watching League Pass. <laughs> Orlando's playing the Hawks. The worst is, you know, you're a fiend. You know, you're a fiend for sports or you're watching on your phone. Oh, don't start. And I Ed get is in, in bed. Every time. And she doesn't even know that I could screen. You can screen share on the TV. And I'm like, I'm just going to screen share this random game. She's like, what are you watching? I don't know. <sighs> it's something odd. But random Giants, man. Random what happened Giants. to Joey Bart? Has anything happened to Joey Bart? Is he on the opening day roster? He's what? on the opening day roster. Is he? Good for hey, him. You should check out that piece of paper I just gave you. Yeah, oh, I was oh, just looking oh, for I, it. Well, I mean, you I know, honestly, Sam, it. quite honestly, I don't need no script. <laughs> he said after asking what's going on with Joey Bart. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's on the roster. He's on the roster. So we're keeping three, three catchers. Tom Murphy, Joey Bart, Patrick Bailey. And you know what? I wouldn't give up hope on the Bart train. I would give up hope. Did he have a good spring? Did he have a good spring, right? It might be late to your destination, but it might get there. Hey, when is Bart ever on time? Oh, at five in the morning when they were taking me to the morning roast, they were on time. Bring back hustling. the Bart pro uh, Chronicles. Come uh, on. No, wait, dude, I, was, I felt like somebody was trying to pull a jack move on me, man. I had to either I get security and pay for it or just drive okay, my Okay, you have the one studio. random reliever with your life on the line. It can't be a good one. It's got to be a random From the Giants? One. Yes. From back in the day. Oh, uh, uh, oh, 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 uh, was it Steve Ayer? Who's my guy? Steve Scott Ayer. Scott Ayer. Scott Ayer. Scott Ayer. Yeah, number 47 or 49. Was he a lefty? Lefty. Yes, yeah. he was a lefty. Wore a Scott Ayer. Yeah. Him or Mike Jackson? Mike Jackson. Well, Mike Jackson closed. was a great he, setup, man. But yeah, I agree but with I, you. He right, is. Right, no, it's obscure. Right. It's obscure, obscure enough. Okay, all right. Mike Jackson used to look at second base yep. as he was throwing so home. He was dominant in the eighth inning. I'm going to go dominant. Big, big Daddy Rick Russell. Oh, that's old school. No, No love for Tyler Walker? Oh my God! Hey, there's University a, the, High School. Yes, and Cal. And Cal. I think Cal number forty five. I swear he was always sweaty on the mound. Always well, sweaty. Well, I remember the home run A Rod hit off him in the ninth <laughs> oh, inning. That's right. For that's the seven. Yankees. We couldn't find a home run for many, many yeah. years. Yeah. He hit it. We couldn't find the to home center run. field. I swear to God, it was a bomb. It was in the ninth. Tyler Walker was like, "I love you. You went to University High School. You're a Red Devil." But damn, at least where we get that ball got hit so hard to dead center. I don't think I've ever seen a ball land that far in center field at Oracle Park. I swear to God, I was like, damn. I actually stood up and gave a round of single yeah. ovation. I was like, wow. <laughs> I was, it was on the Fox Saturday afternoon. Uh, was, I remember that game. They had like an eight-game losing streak yeah. or whatever they ended that day. It was like a 15-inning right. game. Right, dude. It's like, hey, Ron, smite. He uh, saw it coming. He was just hovering around whole plate, and Tyler Walker was sweating, sweating, sweating. I'm like, dude, just walk him. There are certain giants in your head. You say their name and you instantly go back to the moment of their failure yeah. that you will never forget. Like uh, if Hunter I go Strickland. right now, Cody Ransom. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what are Cody you thinking? Ransom. I'm just thinking a utility guy who really couldn't crack the starting lineup. He booted the ball against the Dodgers <laughs> just, in the final weekend I mean, of the year. I mean, oh, Matt Hurgis? What Matt if I say Matt Hurgis? Hurgis? Oh my God. Number 41. <laughs> Remember Hurgis. that? The, the Hurgis Hermanson closer duo? Oh, Dustin like Hermanson. Oh my God. He had incredible facial hair. We had Brett, two closers that we like, put, we basically platooned closers, and everyone was like, yeah, this is cool. Wasn't he good with the White Sox, though? Hermanson? Yeah, wasn't he like yeah. decent? Brett Tomko was really good. That I year. liked Brett Tomko. Tomko dealt in that game. He went eight innings in that game. 
eight innings on a Saturday afternoon at Dodger Stadium. He always threw hard. And he, he was also a, the video game guy when you yep. did a fantasy draft in video games. You'd get him like, oh, I'll use him as my four starter. He throws 95. No, nah, no doubt he does. Brett Tomko. Brett Tomko. I think of him as a red, though. Dude, uh, I do. I, I know a lot of people do. Uh, here's some... Some, uh, yes, Luis Matos was sent to AAA. He will be back soon. Trust me on that one. I hope people are having fun uh, yeah. with us as we go down the Giants rabbit hole. By the way, uh, and Pablo, just feel good. Pablo said the ball has been released. Now, we got some calls here. I'm going to get to Laura yeah. Pleasanton and Willa Moran in just a second uh, as we are talking Giants. 405, random Giants, Shea Hillebrand. Shea Hillebrand traded for at the deadline with the Toronto Blue Jays. Yep. It was him and Ryan Garko in yep. back to back Ryan years. Garko. And everyone was like, Sabian can't do it. Sabian is done. He lost his fastball. Ground ball Garko. Sydney Ponson. <laughs> Ground ball Garko. Sir, 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 Sir Sydney. Blue game two against Sydney the Florida Marlins. Ponson. That was the same year as uh, Damon Moss, too. They Damon traded Moss. him. Damon Moss. They got him oh from God. Atlanta for Russ Ortiz, and Russ Ortiz went out well, and dropped a 21 season. Well, we never saw Damon Moss again. Out. After he went to Wrigley Field, and Felipe Alou pulled him in the fifth inning, gave him like a three-run jack, and Felipe, I was like, yeah, I don't think we'll be seeing this guy anytime soon. I don't think we ever heard from David Boss after that. I think, if I'm not, look this up, I think David Ardsma from Rice was traded <laughs> for Shea Hillenbrand. That's Hillenbrand. how sick I am. No, David Ardsma. I remember, remember David, David Ardsma. Ardsma. Oh, with the two A's in his last <laughs> yes, name. Yes. Yeah, I'll never forget it. <laughs> I got to look it up now. He's at the top of the list in all-time MLB players, like alphabetically, he unseated Hank Aaron. No yes. way. The number one, That's, like... No alphabetically way. by last a, name. No way. That's amazing. That that's incredible. just amazing. God, I just no remember the two ass. It's like David Arnsmaw. I, I don't Who's believe this you. guy. That is that. Who I was the guy from Santa Cruz that they signed to play third base a couple years back? Oh, Casey McGee. <laughs> oh, my God. I had Casey him. Magoo. What? Huh. He was the well, comeback player of the year the year well, before with the Marlins. Of course well, hold he was. on, hold on. Let me, I got to go down John Wilson's rabbit hole. John oh Wilson used to work God. in ABC Sports Bay Area. Uh. They have another radio station. He's the guy who told me, Bonte, you really think you're going to make it in this market? You're going to have to go to Fresno or something. I said, damn it, I can roll with the big dogs. I ain't going anywhere. But I love you, John Wilson. But when they signed Casey McGee, we argued. I said, this is who we replaced Pablo with? He goes, <laughs> He's got a better OPS than Pablo Sandoval. He was DFA within months. <laughs> Dude, he couldn't hit anything out the infield. Okay. Casey McGee. What's up? Oh, the Giants uh, dropped their opening day lineup. You guys are. Oh, so one let second. Hit. Let me close the Hill and Brand file. Go, uh, it, can you go pit a fever? Yeah, with but this give me one? a second. Let me close the Shea right. Hill and Brand. He was designated for assignment, and then two days later, this is from the Toronto Blue Jays because Lyle Overbay was taking his job. <laughs> Lyle Overbay. <laughs> Some of these names. They, Lyle, I do remember Lyle yeah, Overbay. The Giants traded Vinny Chulk <laughs> and Jeremy Accardo. <laughs> Jeremy not Accardo. David Arzma. Jamie Accardo. I knew it was an A. Jeremy Accardo. Well, listen to this. Solid Jesus. closer. Sort I mean, oh my gosh! By the way, if right. I just say Lyle Overbay, that right. does that not spark no, like it, your it, mind? It, it sparks '90s baseball, man. I love, I love this stuff. We're we'll gonna have a lot of fun with All this right. baseball season. Laura, will hey, God, tight. We're gonna get you right at the reveal of the lineup. Laura wants to talk Ludie and Draymond. We'll get to her. We'll get to Willa Murray, who wants to talk about Giants utility players. So hang tight as we go through. Give me that pit of fever music. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Give it to me. Give me All that right. lineup, Lopman. You guys ready? Leading off for the Giants in center field. It's Jung Hoo Lee. Oh, oh, I've decided. Let's go. This. 51. Uh, the like best this. 51 since Noah Lowry? Oh, gosh. Randy Johnson. Yeah, well, no, it's good for the Lowry. Noah Lowry was a good giant. He was a great giant. He was, he was right. a good giant. Ladies, bad. his career. He wasn't the high bad. school girls loved Dude, Noah why, Lowry. Why you got to go to the high school girls? Because when about, I was in high school. How about you just say the girls? They, the girls loved him. They did. You, feel, you, feel, look, you got me thinking about Kevin Barlow when you say that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> don't don't, don't do that. that. All right, number two. Who's back second? second. About Stop, Kevin. dude. Why Stop I, it. You, he was dating the high school girls a lot. He was dating the high school girls. Love everybody, right? They're, 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 they're growing up. They're, they're, you know, they're going, going through that time. That baby Chaz is going to go through. All right, anyway. Number two is bad second. Oh, my God. Batting second at DH, it's Jorge Soler. Let's go. Oh, oh they got a bad second. I wow. like that. Wow. Batting third at first base, Lamont Wade Jr. <laughs> wow. Well, wait, wow, well, they're going um, against the righty. It's yeah, a righty. Right. He's hitting three thirty three against you, Darvish, in his career, whereas Ooh. Wilmer Flores isn't as good. Uh, Who is he, three for nine? And well, like 14 at-bats. Yeah, something. exactly. Yeah, right. well, I, I, keep, keep cooking, love keep it. Going, keep cooking. Keep going. Anyway, batting cleanup at third base, it's Matt Chapman. Oh, batting cleanup. Okay. Clean up. Mm, batting clean. fifth in right field, Mike Yastrzemski. Wow, that's high for him. Mm. All right, who's Batting that? sixth, that's second base, Tyro Estrada. Where's right. Conforto? Batting seventh in left field, Michael Conforto. Yeah, I don't like that. I'd you got to flip, flip that. him in the ass, yeah, but yeah, keep going. Yeah, yeah, right. Batting going. eighth, and in the squat, it's Patrick Bailey. And batting ninth, <laughs> that's short. That was not a good squat. <laughs> batting ninth, that was a two. <laughs> in the squat. Is that a little bit better? Two. Yeah, that's better. You got to get more enthusiastic. Yeah. But a squat. And then batting ninth, that's shortstop. 
It's Nick Ahmed. See, all right. This ain't going to be the lineup every single day, but what I envision, and I hope it yeah. comes to fruition, yeah. is that Jung Hoo Lee, uh-huh. that's first, uh-huh. lead off. You get Luis Matos batting second, his speed, his athleticism. Yeah. I need that second. Then you get Soler in that third spot and clean up. Then you get Matt Chapman, or you can flip flop and you can get the lineup deeper. You go Lamont Wade Jr. or Wilmer Flores third. And then you get Soler, Chapman, and Conforto. Yaz batting fifth is too high to line up. So can you do me a favor? Could someone pick up in 2010, the year we it came out of nowhere of them winning it all and they won the West that year? Can you give me the opening day lineup and how yeah. different it was for the? I'm sure we had Renneria in there. I'm sure Pablo was in there. Uh, who would be at second base you to start? The, was it DeRosa to start the year at second base? 2010. 2010. First base, was it Aubrey Huff? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Want me to go through this. the lineup right now? Yeah, yeah give me the 2010 opening day. the Astros uh, 5 2 at Houston. 5 2 at Houston. So the opening day lineup. Air Rowan at center. Air Rowan. He, Edgar Ritteria with 2 he for lost 3. lost his job to Andres Torres. <laughs> yes, he did. Uh, 2 or 3. Edgar Ritteria. Edgar Ritteria. Pablo Sandoval, third base. Uh huh. Aubrey Huff batting cleanup. Yep. Mark DeRosa batting fifth. See, and he had broke his wrist. He was out for the year. Actually hit a whole run that, that game. Yeah. Uh, Benji Molina Benji batting six. Benji Molina before Posey became, wow. And the squad. Uh, <laughs> the squad. John Bowker. John Bowker! Batting seventh in right field. John I think he was leading the team in home runs at the All-Star break that wow. year. Wow. Wade Ribe. John Bowker, eight. my dad used to call him the extreme pop-up guy. Yeah, he was the extreme pop-up <laughs> he guy. He was. Uh, John, oh, he did, he, John freaking Bowker. Bowker. Gosh, yeah. Hey, uh, who was, man, who was, was after Bowker? Right I almost curse right there about Bonker. Uh, <laughs> uh, Juan Uribe <Bucky> second. <laughs> second base, Juan Uribe. Juan Uribe, who took then, the shortstop job right, for and, quite a long time, then moved to third. And Tim Lynch could set the tone. Yeah. Seven innings, gave up four hits, seven strikeouts, gave up no runs, and the Giants beat so, Roy Oswald in that Roy season Oswald, opener. Roy Oswald, who uh, would then go to the Phillies that year. Yep, Ryan Wilson wow. got the save. No, that's that's Brandon Manners. Brandon that Manners that gave up oh, two. No. Brandon Manners tried to blow the game. Uh, that was so... Brian Wilson got the save there. So, but my point that I'm going at is, think of how different that 2010 team was by the time they got to the playoffs. You acquired Freddie Sanchez. Yep. You acquired Pat Burrell. Uh, you brought up Buster Posey. Things are going to happen. Yep. So even though it's day one, things are going to happen. Things will happen. And it's going to look I a mean, lot different. think about it. Connor Joe was starting opening day in 2018. <laughs> Joe. All right. I'm a little surprised he's still in the bigs. I'm yeah, not going to lie. He actually had a... <laughs> He had a nice little run. Yeah, not not a bad. He's still with Colorado, right? I, t- I, I uh, can't Pittsburgh, get I yeah think. Pittsburgh. I can't get good. over John Bowker and left. Yeah, yeah uh, John Bowker. He had some sort of. Problem. I was a Freddie Lewis guy. I liked Freddie Lewis, and I I was. 